Hi, I'm the Space Quest Historian, and welcome to Lust for Darkness. This is a game that's currently in development. Uh, it's uh, a game that I have uh, kickstarted because it looked really interesting. The premise is that it's one of those erotic fiction games meets Lovecraftian horror other dimension type thing. So. It promises two things I really love, horrific alternate dimensions and boobies. So, I mean, you gotta get there. So please be warned, this video will most likely have some very not safe for work content. And also, this is a beta that at the time of this recording just came out a couple of days ago. So this is not the final version, this is just the beta. Uh, I am intrigued in finding out just what in the hell this thing is though. So let's get in and New game, this fucker. The Earth is ours already. Time to find out what is hiding among the stars, and I think that's the sign of Mercury, though it does appear to be melting a bit. So someone took a lighter to this thing. Also, it is loading phenomenally slowly. But again, it's- well, I just picked up steam there. But then, yeah, it is a, a beta, so it is not the final game. I think I said that already. All right. Let's get in and see what kind of horrific nudity. No, I cannot. It was George Costanza. Really, this is the world's worst pillow talk. Stop it. No, I don't think we are. This sounds like someone's been dropping the shrooms. Yeah, that's pretty much how this thing works. It's gonna get really unreal in a second. Ah, the sex dungeon! Great place to wake up. Let me guess. Amnesia? No. Oh, someone left us a rose. That's, that's really very thoughtful of them. And things are a bit blurry. Bet we hit the tequila a bit hard last night. Ah, very nice thing to wake up to. What is this place? Yep, it's amnesia. I called it. <laughs> and we are in control. New objective, escape from the room. Now, where have I heard that phrase before? Anyway, oh, someone left us a very kind note next to the rose, which we can do nothing with. So let's just have a look-see. Dear Amanda, this evening at 6.30pm, I'm going to collect you from your new home. New home? I didn't know I had an old home. I sincerely hope that you, that like me, you can't wait for our first date to happen. Do not worry. I shall take care of everything. Now, there's an immediate alarm bell going off when people say, do not worry, as in, uh, it, it, instead of don't worry. All you need to do is follow the path of love. I'm looking forward to our romantic tete-a-tete. Yours truly, W.D. Yelverton. And we can rotate this with the right mouse button. Ah, uh, he seems to be quite infatuated with this symbol. What, date? what fucking date? Uh, today's date, maybe? What is in this thing? Will you open and reveal your secrets to me? Open. Ah, there's a key! Well, that about concludes this demo. I think I'm gonna escape from the room now. I'm gonna take you. Thank you. Anything else we should be interested? Ah, oh, the game is running a little sluggish. Sorry about that. I looked in the settings and there was only one uh, graphic setting. It was called Fantastic. So this is uh, the game running in Fantastic mode, but I think there's still some optimization uh, to do. Um, well, let's see. Uh, opened with key. Cool. Can I open you? Can I push you? Oh, oh, oh it's... It's observer rules. I'm supposed to push it. I am trying to push it. Get <laughs> so many tequila shots. Can't even operate a simple fucking door. Come on. Open. There you go. That at a girl. There we go. And now we escape from the basement. Nothing in this direction except a doorway. Which leads into... The box room. Holy shit, this is running at bug up my ass frames per second. Very jittery. Hope we can get past that. Ah, uh, let's see what the uh, seller has to offer. Do not adjust your set. This is perfectly normal. Um, 
<laughs> yes. Holy Christ. Well, this guy's begging on candles. Let's just stand here and set ourselves on fire, shall we? Very nice. Is that blood? That does look like blood. Yes. Mm. Oh my. What are you? Hi, how are you doing? Um, sir, 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 could you come back, please? I, I really have, I have questions. I have many questions. Um, I also seem to be having some respiratory problems. Can I open this? Yep, yeah, there you go. There you go. Go, there, up, we go. Ah, uh, there you go. Okay. So, someone should really speak to the interior decorator. There seems to be, um, mannequins with boobies on the floor and boxes. Uh, quite the impressive collection you have. Wait, what? Where, where did I go? Did I come from here? I've lost my way already. Yep, that, that. Awesome. Can I run? Nope. Holding down shift. Nothing happens. What's in here then? Ah, the flashing wine cellar. Could we perhaps just have some hair of the dog or something to pick and lift up our spirits. No? Well, at least we have seating arrangements. Should that ever come in hand? Okay, see, doors are just our natural enemy in this game. You fucking... Oh, I just, just sort of walked into it and it opened. Okay. Well, I see we have accomplished objective number two. What are you? Vino Rosso. Yeah, uh, no, I wanted to open it. I didn't want to... There you go. Um, so, no? Screwdriver? What is this? Yeah, uh, not, not a screw. Oh, a wine opener. Can't really use that for anything. Nor this. Okay, so we know where to get booze if we need it. And Lord knows we might need it sometime. Um, hmm. Alright, cool. Let's just head upstairs. Ah, uh, more of that mercury thingy. Yes, hello. Music picked up. Hi? Anyone? Yes, you shouldn't leave candles on the floor. That's really a fire hazard. Although, I really feel like I'm being kind of led somewhere. Joke. Perhaps to the bed arrangement. Dear me. Okay, cool. Cool, yeah. Should I put this on? Sir? Master? Anyone? No? No, oh, that's okay. I see! Yes, yes, I... The best seat in the house, I see. <laughs> okay, cool. Very nice. And this thing? Does this operate? This really doesn't seem to be doing much of anything. This is just a... Uh, oh, it's a... Uh, it's a tickler. Oh, very nice. But where do you, do you just sort of... You have to like sit at the top. Oh, you have to you have to sort of um, squat on top of this thing, and you just pull the handle, and immense pleasure occurs. Yes, yes. Good, 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 good. And this is just a nice place to sit, really. Just recline, and uh, possibly wear this so you won't be disturbed. I'm guessing this is a headphone of some kind. Now, uh, you don't have to tell me to go look up on porn tube or whatever those things are called. Oh, very nice. Then we got the little veinies. Ah, and a little heart symbol. That's fucking adorable. Good, good, very good. So I see the evening has been prepared quite meticulously. And so, really, really, you, um, I mean, this, this is very nice of you, but, um, we should perhaps wait until we've been properly introduced. And you're quite noisy as well. Uh, some stirrups or perhaps places to tie us down. To oh, yes, yes, very good. Very good. Uh, and a sort of vagina-shaped statue. Awesome. awesome. Ah, fuck me. Dude, um, sir, sir, buy me dinner, at least. Jesus Christ. Loud noises, Jesus. A year has passed since Amanda went missing. In a state of heightened pleasure. <laughs> After that time, her husband, Jonathan, receives a letter from Amanda herself. Don't come looking for me. I'm having a whale of a time. In it, Amanda asks her beloved not to inform her something-something secluded mansion, where the truth will be revealed. 
It would seem like Amanda is not really in as much distress as she was letting on. Uh, so, okay, the first star of the primeval archipelago. Sorry, I've I've seen that word before. I don't know how to pronounce it. Has blazed. Four twenty. Let us follow its luster to the lands which our minds shall not harness. Ah, good double entendre use of the word harness. Absolutely excellent. God damn it. Okay, Mr. Masked Man. Sir. The objective, look around the mansion. I kind of did that already, except I just started from the bottom. Dear guests of the association, the great ceremony will start tonight at midnight. Enjoy the mansion's charms in the last hours of your humanity. Wow, that took a turn. Cool, cool, very cool. Hi, how's everyone doing? Everyone good? Who are those people? I have a bad feeling about this. And a very peculiar accent. But that is all right with me. Yes, good evening, sir. How is everyone? Hello? You are a person with a very scary mask. Ooh, yes, yes. <laughs> very nice to meet you. Uh, sir, you are less scary, so I'm going to get right up in your face. Cool. Hi. How are you? And you just appear to be made of plastic. Awesome. Cool. What is that? Is that tequila? Is that... You're not even drinking anything. In fact, your hand is going right through the glass. Dude. Miss... Ma'am. Ma ma sir. Sorry. Whatever. Um... Cool, I shall not bother you anymore. And you guys? My friend. Yes, I have all of it. Yeah, I, I like the band Ghost as much as anyone. Yeah, I'm just gonna have a look around. Sir, sir. oh, not joining the party, eh, Anton? No? The day of ultimate lechery has come. Yeah, we shall sure. drown in the embrace of a better world. Oh, absolutely. Can't fucking wait. Dude, gonna be righteous, man. All right, set up the stairs. Do some spelunking. Is this uh, the Sangria Bowl? No, sorry, sadly, no. I think we need to go down and check out that wine cellar again. Hi, Benedict Yelverton. That looked like a button I could press, but it is not. Look at that scary face. Booga booga booga. Yes. Ah, uh, some literature. If you get bored with all the tits and ass and masks, cool. Um, <laughs> awesome. Can't even open it. Fine, put you right back. Uh, let's see, what else we got? Can we just look through these people's drawers? Haha, <laughs> drawers, get it? Yes, I mask my, um, uh, what, what, um, <laughs> I mask, I, j I just got that. Yes, I mask my uncertainty uh, with humor. What very, very poor choice of humor. Closed. Sad, that looked like an awesome place. Hello? Oh, Jesus, this opens. I can break antiques. Cool. I'm just going to pick these up, have a look at them. Uh, does this, is, is this in fact the cup of a carpenter? No, no. I need a good polish, surely. Yeah, I'll put you back. Yes, quite. I'll leave you open and uh, walk through this door. Where a nice tea party has been set. Cool, I can pick all of this shit up for no fucking reason whatsoever. Have a look through the drawers once again. An identical drawer. Cool. Cool. I'ma open all your shit. Does any of these books pull out and then like a secret passageway opens up? Because that would also be cool. Um, hmm? No? Well, I'ma open everything. Just to be a dick. I am the worst house guest you've ever had. See, doors are my nemesis in this game. Closed. Sad. Very sad. Uh, what a view. Oh. She's watching me. Oh, would the constant glare in your direction, like with n not even the slightest hint of subterfuge, be a possible giveaway? I don't know how this works, but uh, as you can see, I'm not even capable of opening a fucking door on my own, so might need some help with that. There you go. Bars through that thing. That hair. Looks just like Amanda's. Maybe it's. No. That'd be too much. No, she would comb her hair much better. Alright, I'ma follow the woman. Since this door just opened up. Cool. Did you go in here, my dear? Darling? Honey? Penis? Really? Uh, those? Um. Wow. That's very progressive of you. Very nice. I like that. Yes? 
Sorry. Oh, yeah. I'm 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 gonna just go through the um, open doors. That seems prudent at this time. Ah, a bit of candlelit dinner, perhaps. Yes. Or no? No. Are you in the birdcage, my dear? Are you in here? No. There isn't even a bird in here. What kind of fucking hollow place is this? Yes. Yes. As soon as I get this door open, things will happen. I'm absolutely positive of it. Perfumes. Just like in Amanda's room. She lives here? <laughs> and she left me just like that. Like that. What the fuck is this? What in the fuck is all of this? If it's such Amanda's room. Uh, and then some people in masks are gonna cart me off and strap me down to that uh, pussy licking chair. That'll be great. Have wanted to do that for quite a while. Oh, yes, yes. And you are the uh, lament configuration. If I push enough of these buttons, uh, uh, spikes will shoot out the walls. I'm sure of it. It'd be great. It'll be fine. Have a look. Closed. Yes, I can see that. I'm trying to open it. Are these the books that Amanda used to read? Addith. Yes. Yes. The Book of Mold. I see it. And the Bible. All right. Uh, can we sniff the sheets? Has anything been going on here? Maybe I should just close the door. This. I mean, I really... I, I wish I'd never said that. Want to close the? There you go. Hmm. Is this in Amanda's size? I wonder. I'm gonna just reach out and reach out and touch Faith. Amanda, are you in here, darling? I'm gonna look through your shit. Look through your suitcase. Can't look through your suitcase. God damn it! And see, when I see an armoire like this, I am reminded of that blockbuster game I helped write for Serena. I'm just expecting a fucking dead body in there. Um. The amazing auto-closing drawer contains a pair of shoes and a quilt, and uh, I have a feeling I'm missing something very important here. I'm open you, I'm open you. I'm, all of these books seem very important and very fiddly with inviting, and none, uh, and I just look like a, like a like I'm having a seizure of some kind, just always bobbing my head up and down as I'm opening and closing drawers. No? 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 Ah! Fucking walked right into that one. Um, hello? Very literally walked right into that one. You, you. Amanda's yeah. favorite perfume. I'd recognize it anywhere. So was it made specifically for her? I mean, th there must be other women in this world who have that perfume. That one's closed, sadly. Ah, Mr. Framerate, would you All please? All paintings are by David Kapfgeller. Amanda's always loved his work. And when she was kidnapped, the kidnapper thoughtfully brought all of these paintings with him or her so that she would have something homely and familiar to look at. Uh, let's see, I'm having a having the feeling that every time I run into the... Um, ah, jeez, <laughs> trying to close the door here. Every time I run into the um, magnifying glass icon, this uh, these are clues... Would you shut? Please, fuck. I gotta just slam that fucker shut. Um, that means that I'm uncovering some clues, perhaps a trigger, that will help me progress in the game. Is this also her favorite perfume? Excellent. Except I am kind of running out of things to poke and prod at. Oh, bugger me. This is some sort of puzzly thing. And these all turn. Great. Oh, I really wanted this to be a thing. Okay. Well, that looks pretty good. Wouldn't you say? No? I think this is an arrowy type thing. Ah, ah. There we go. And can I open you? Yes. Ah, here we are. Yes, I will also open the letter. Darling. Yes, I know it's unimaginable for you, but this is the truth. Just accept that and everything will be revealed soon. It is me, Amanda, your wife, in case you were wondering. The love of your life. Until recently, because now I found out that I actually hate your guts. I apologize. This one word must be enough for this moment. Please stay in the mansion and be careful. Do not pay any attention. Don't do what you've been doing thus far. Just don't pay 
any attention. Everything will be fine, but you must help me. Help us, in fact, but really, without paying attention. Did I stress that? That's really important. Don't pay attention. Please, wait for the next clues. I love you. So it's true. She's really here. Dear God, at least she's alive. I need to get her out of here. Yes, but don't pay attention to anything. Okay, look for Amanda. Still closed. Right, did, did we get a complimentary mask? I mean, can we just walk around undetected? Right, time to head back to the amazing penis room. Where things are getting a little fucking weird. What? Uh, sir, ma'am, whatever. Could you help me out here, please? Anyone? No? No? Okay. Well, Jesus. Yes, yes, this is very much what I wanted. Um, I'm gonna just, uh, this looks very inviting. Yes, it's a chair made up of, uh, uh, lady parts and bone, I think? Hello? Hi, can you, uh, shed some light on this, perhaps? No? No, you look very nice. I'm gonna put you back. What the hell? Uh, it's, what, where, where, where did the fancy chair go? Um... Hey, that was weird. And it went away. Oh god, no, I, I missed the vagina chair. <laughs> well, I'm quite sure they're not dead. I think they might just be off somewhere fucking. I don't know, Just it's just a guess on my part. I gather if I walk down here towards the very loud violin music, I am certain Something interesting is happening beyond these doors, or velvety drapey things. Hello? In eternal darkness, beyond the final frontier of our universe, roars the lustful god's silent scream. They are calling us, and our bodies are calling them. Wow, my mouth suddenly got a bit dry. Come on. Just, uh, stay hydrated when you're having a weird masked orgy, please. Ah, yes, fluids. We're gonna need them. Cool. Uh, someone's tuning their violin. Ah. Well, you look like you're having fun. Uh, can I ask you a couple of questions? No? No, you just seem to be in a writhing moment. Yeah, that's good. Not even really doing much. You just... You know, they didn't even get undressed. What kind of fucking masked orgy is this anyway? There's only one person and she's still clothed. I'm disappointed. Um, okay. All of this shit? Should I be wearing any of this? No? How about this? I don't really want to wear that, to be honest. Uh, it would kind of hinder my, uh, my thing. I need to get in the zone. Ah, yes. Some erotic dancing. Oh, you're doing very well. Ah, nice tits, lady. Very nice. Hello? Can I ask you something? Oh, there's that weird uh, three-headed masky thing. Very nice. Very nice. Yes, you're doing you're doing a grand job. Keep keep doing it. Uh, you too. Although, uh, oh oh, I see. Yes. Ooh. Can even watch the. Nike. Nah, he doesn't seem to have a bit. But anyway, yes, yes, all doing very well. Uh, you too. You too. Keep it up. Keep it up. Everything is going swimmingly. Dude, would you calm your ass down? People are just having some very innocuous fucking, actually. It didn't even seem to be that, uh, uh, like, immense or, like... Unless there's some freaky shit going on, it's kind of vanilla at this point. Um, this is also quite vanilla. I mean, I was expecting, like, blood orgies and, uh, you know, people being strapped into objects, uh, you know, the, the pussy-licking machine certainly uh, was a lot more exciting than this, and it didn't even have an occupant. Um, maybe I've just spent too much time on the internet, I don't know. Although that little portally thing down there looks mighty interesting. I think I shall have to <laughs> spend 20 minutes trying to open this door and then go in and have a look, see. Do I have a f What? Did oh, did you just change on me? Oh, goody. There we go again. With the creepiness and the whatnot. Also, is 
Oh, that's just the rain. I thought the universe was flashing by over there. Uh, hello? Mr. Vagina Buttplug? Are you a candle, perhaps? Can I light you? No? I'm gonna just put you down. You don't look safe. Hello? Out there? Anyone? I'm gonna just uh, float towards the window. Like you do. Up towards the cosmos. And, uh... Whoa! Shoop Niggurath decided to join the sex party. That's amazing. That, I mean, someone really... If you're gonna have a, a like, clashy sex party, masks, velvet drapes... Thank you for playing the demo version of the game Lust for Darkness. Oh, yes. We hope you're awaiting the great ceremony as we are, definitely. I mean, if you're really gonna have that a big, great masked sex orgy, you gotta have some Cthulhu in there. You gotta have some Elder Gods. Shit's about to get real. <laughs> so anyway, that actually looks really interesting. I hope they uh, sort of fix the... Um, uh, I mean, this was kind of choppy. Uh, and, and I hope they do optimize the game uh, once it comes out, because it's a it's a nice machine I have, um, but it's, um, it's not able to keep up, as you can plainly see. And uh, inside the options menu here, you have quality, and it... it it's there's just one quality setting so i i have a feeling they're gonna get in there and fix that but other than that this is really interesting so i hope that um well i hope they do really well with this and i'm gonna play the rest of it when it comes out so we can have some nice adult time together uh, with my juvenile humor that'll be quite the combination but anyway thank you so much for watching this i hope you didn't get in trouble for watching this at work and or if you're watching this in your room and your mom just barged in in which case there really are better ways to um expend that kind of energy than watching me play through an erotic fiction game but i'm not here to tell you how to do that ask your dad or mom but depending on you i'm not really going anywhere with this anyway thank you so much for watching this please like subscribe do whatever you kids do but do leave me a comment because i really really enjoy the comments so uh thank you and i will see you around that naughty naughty chrono stream yeah 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 very very